G'day everyone. This week we better we're bringing you some news, some hot off the press news. Well, maybe not so much hot off the press, <laughs> but uh, so it's lukewarm off the press news. It's, it's lukewarm, but uh, but yeah. you know you may not have noticed, but if you tried to listen to podcasts on the iPad, uh, you may be disappointed. Why can't you? Why can't you find them? What's happened? Uh, until on. you find what app are we looking at now, Garth? Everything's changed. Well, I, iTunes aren't going to do podcasts anymore, are they? The Apple's just decided that podcasts are, you know, not making enough money out of it. Dropped, so them, they, dropped yeah. them like a school case. Completely gone. No, that's not true. That's not right. <laughs> no, they wouldn't do that to us, would they? I hope not. No. I hope not. So, no, they've um, actually moved the podcasts out of iTunes. So, out of the music app on your phone or on your iPad, um, I didn't think a lot of this was supposed to happen until iOS 6 was released. Um, but right now, on your iPad, there's no iTunes Pod- U yes. and there's no podcast. Yeah, so if you want to listen to the, if you're on your iPad, now apparently Garth is still on the iPhone, yes, but it's so not on the it's iPad. It's still there on the under the More tab. So in the Music app, you had to go digging to find the i you know um, your podcast. You had to go into the More tab and the bottom mm. of that was Podcasts yep. and iTunes U. And they're still there. Um, you can also download the independent. Now you can get you know the app for podcasts as well. A while ago they released the app for the iTunes U, um, but now they've got the podcast app as well. All right. So so, so nowadays you've you've got to go to the App Store, download the podcasts app. That's right. So I guess when I Apple do release iOS six whether or not they will include the podcast app as one of the default apps that comes installed. Frankly, I doubt they will. Um, I don't know. They should. They should, but I, I think it's going to be, unfortunately, something that people are going to have to go and grab if they want to listen to their podcasts. Mm. Um, that's, that's of course, if they're not using one of the other dedicated um, podcaster apps. But why would you think that would be? Why have they moved it out? Yeah. Is yeah, there I don't know. I mean, it's nice to start to de-bloat that a little bit. It hasn't helped with the... Um, you know, iTunes on the on the PC or the Mac, that's still just got every single thing happening in it. It's just huge, slow piece of yeah, but that's all right. annoying app. <laughs> <laughs> but I guess it's good on you know I, you know on iOS that they have started to move those things into independent apps. Mm. Um, so look, th- th- there's two different layouts. There's a different uh, GUI for the iPhone and a different GUI for the iPad. Yeah. And look, the iPhone one looks pretty pretty sexy. Yeah, they've gone for a bit of an old style radio look to it a bit. Yeah, and then and then you've yeah. got the iPad one, which is v- it, which obviously can uh, get larger graphics and yeah. just looks a little bit different as well. There's so a lovely little thing that you know with the iPad where it'll show you a reel to reel tape deck when you're listening to auto audio. Right, right. And um, so you just do a swipe up, and there it is. And you know the wheels as you listen through a track, the tape moves from one side through to the other. <laughs> right. Yeah. So nice. Nice. Yeah, it's a bit you know. Yeah, gimmicky, I guess, but it's it's you know it's nice. Yeah. yeah. So if you have if you're wanting to s- wonder where's the where's my podcast on the iPad, that's what's happened. You have go to go down. The, go grab the podcast app. Go and down. Um, one thing I liked about it actually, when I installed the app, it automatically knew what podcast I'd subscribed to within iTunes itself. Right. And it stuff. was all set up ready to go. So I think you need to be on the latest release of iTunes as well for that to work. Mm. Yeah. So there you go. So the requ- the requirements for the podcast app. Uh, surprisingly, would you say iPhone 3GS? Back as far as that. There you go. Uh, yeah, or the, uh, yeah, as it's Garth said, 5.1 or later. So uh, thanks, Garth, and uh, download that app because that's what the way of the future by the look of it. So, um, Seems to be. Yeah, if you want to keep listening to us on iOS, download the free app from Apple. Bye-bye. Excellent. See ya.